Party cartridge plague attack. Awesome condition. Oh, so, let's take a look at it. The cartridges are getting more expensive. Uh, once you get the uh, common games, the more known games you get past the $20 range, they become around 30 40 bucks. So uh, this one's 30 bucks. But the sellers can easily price them different if they have the box. So. I don't really buy them with the box because they're more expensive. Plus, I I just want the game anyway. I'm not like a hardcore collector for Atari, but I do want to get as many games as possible that I can afford. They go up pretty quick once you get past the common games. So I paid off. Some of my balance this month. I think another two, three weeks, I'll be in, a good, in good shape. I do not want to go back into debt after another month. When, once you start building your collection, sometimes you have to buy the games ahead, and that's what I did. But it's because it's really hard, and you have to have your food budget in check. You have to have your art stuff in check. And you want to get some games, and sometimes you have to balance things out over a couple months. But if you go out too far, it could be very hard. So is that kind of like cemetery council? They're complete, they're very expensive. So they could cost easily two, three hundred bucks if they have more games. Or if you're buying game bundles, they could be very expensive. And you build doubles up that way very quickly, so just keep that in mind. But however you start your collection, it's gonna take money. So uh, I kinda put the music on hold for a little bit for a couple months and then I'll get back into music again. So I kind of go back and forth, music, games, stuff like that. But yeah, art, it's very expensive. So unless you're planning to do school and you're just buying art supplies for yourself, you cannot do nothing else unless you have a really good job and you're getting a paycheck every week then you could do more stuff but you're doing part time is pretty hard and Atari games they get very expensive as well. I try to buy ones that are good good condition. That's not gonna be always the case. That's how it is with the Atari games, with games in general. I think but most of I've seen that with Atari. If they have really crappy labels. I haven't seen that with the Nintendo too much. Usually they're really good shape. So I want to get back into some Nintendo games as well. So I have both well, the systems paid off now, but I mean when it comes to October I'll pay off a bit more of a chunk then I'll be okay. I only own a very little bit. And I could deal with that a lot more. Be a lot better for me. Well, thanks for watching. Good luck with your collection. Let me know what you're adding to your collection. Play attack.